the new Iron Man. Hey guys, Rex here. Welcome back for another Fortnite video. Well, another item shop review. So today we got actually got a new Marvel Zero War character, and that's actually a new stat. That's actually a new Iron Man Zero. So technically, this is what the Iron Man Zero actually looked like. If you guys haven't seen the, if you guys haven't seen my review of the gun wrap. I will actually leave the link in the description down below if you guys want to take a look at that. So, in the Iron Man Zero Bundle, so, yeah, for that, since I already own the, the, uh, the Iron, the Stark 7, here's what the Iron Man Zero look like, and oh my goodness, he looks so nice. And plus it has like two select two selectable styles. Well actually plus a three selectable style, even including an interesting style to it, like so let me preview his style. So we got the original color scheme with with his Iron Man vibe into it. Even though he, even though he's have wearing he's wearing the Hulkbuster suit and stuff like that. And here he is with the with the helmet off. I kinda like the I kinda like how that look. And plus he has, and plus he has two select selection. We got the seven style, so that's why the Stark Seven is actually the tease of the Iron Man Zero. And plus, for people who are, own all five comic books, that's what you getting is the Iron Man Zero for free. But even though I don't even have all five, all I got is all three. But here we are. We got three selectable styles for Iron Man. Here we got Viper. Orbital. That looks insane. Actually, kind of looks. That looks pretty cool. Igor. Igor. And last but not least, the Mark Seven. That actually looks so cool. The Mark Seven visor looks cool. Here's his back bling called the Repulsor Pack. Has two look two selectable stars, like same thing like always. The other looks interesting. And of course he has his harvesting tool that's actually a built might might be a built-in. I find includes a built-in pickaxe, a transformation emote. So yeah, this one has a built-in pickaxe, so it's called the Blight Gauntlet, even though it's a big gauntlet. That's a big blade. And here's his harvesting, and here's, and here's the built-in emote. And that looks so cool. Combined with, combined with Iron Man tech and the 7 technology. And this is what he actually looked like. Even though it's more like a Hulkbuster 7, st 7 st to it. And this is what the Stark 7 looks like. The garden wrap again. If you guys, if you guys want to see it, my best is you might look at my videos. And here's the loading screen. Oh my goodness, I've pushed the wrong button. So here's the loading screen of Stark Seven. I mean, let's say Iron Man Zero, and that actually looks pretty cool. And for again gifting the full set, it's literally is two thousand V bucks. <laughs> but if you have, but even though if you guys even only got is the it's gun wrap from the comic book, from the Zero War comic book two, you already get is thousand five hundred V bucks. So there's that. Even though I only have thousand three hundred eighty and I'm like two hundred away, so I'm I'm getting I'm getting there. It would be interesting if I got if I got gifted by the Iron Man Zero set, but that would be pretty cool. So we got the Arctic Command bundle that gives you Arctic Assassin and Absolute Zero, plus with the Icebreaker, Icebreaker Harvesting Tool and a Snow Squall. I don't know, I haven't seen those. Wait, where they been? Oh, that's from season one. All oh, these from season one. Oh my goodness, I haven't seen that in a while. 
Glammy Bunny's back in the owl shop. I haven't I haven't seen her in a while. I think she's a Halloween skin, I'm guessing. Yep, she's from chat no, it's just from no, she's not a Halloween skin. She's just, it's from chapter three season one. What the heck? We got Pepper Thrones and she's from chapter two season seven. No, oh, that's where the aliens evaded. And then we got the Hedgeman bundle that gives you Shadow Enforcer and Ghosts. Triggerfish is back in the arm shop. That comes, that has two, three selectable styles. Like if he has, if he has war paint with the bandana, with no face paint, or with a helmet. And of course we get the Coral Commandos. And he has a, a reacted to it. And when it's playing musics, Devastator. And then that's just a ripoff Jonesy. Bully. Perma moves. Copyright emote. Break it on. Yeah, it's it's a vibe. I mean that's copyrighted. In space. So we got Ripley and the Xenomorph bundled. Even though it just came back in the arm shop yesterday. And just even though you know you guys have already seen my me with um me doing that xenomorph running around in the xenomorph even though I call it xeno style. So yeah. So here's what the xenomorph look like with his back bling. It co even comes with Ellen and Ripley with her back bling and of course with the xeno slurp. But yeah, with the Xenos slurp, bon, Lona screen, and of course, the Xenomorph. Yeah, the Xenomorph's built-in harvesting tool. And of course, with the Space Gear bundle that comes with Burst Case Scenario, P500 Power Loader Arm, and last but not least, the Trevelin Dropship. I can even though I like that glider is actually secretly reactive. Spanic bundle is in the arm shop if you guys want to get your hands on the Spanic bundle. Even though he's, I don't know where he plays, but he has an interesting, he's actually has some interesting um, selectable style. He has actually an interesting style to it, even though he has a reactive style. And of course, we got. Sorry for a stunt, and though it's more like um, Spider-Man, and then we're, and then for even though you guys already did notice, I already bought the star the new starter pack season that just came in. That's like four dollars, but here's the Crossmark operative operative pack. If you guys want to get it, it's only like I don't know how much, and then we got a new Fortnite crew skin that's coming in October. Or should I say the end of September? But here we are. We got so we got a new outfit. So let me go ahead and reveal it to you guys. This is Red Claw. He actually has two selectable styles. He has one with a mask and without it. And he looks like he has wearing a cybernetic arm. It looks pretty cool. And he has a black fang back bling. I kind of like that to it. And in my end of the back bling, my might be coming with reactivity. And then we get the Wed Rippers. I mean, that looks pretty cool. And then we get the Shard on Red. It's an interesting gun wrap. And last but not least, his learning screen. And this is what it actually looks like in the learning screen. It looks pretty cool. It says, never take me alive. So, yeah. Also, if you guys want to try and get your hands on Loveless before she leaves. Before she leaves in at least a few, few months. So, yeah. And you guys might wonder how far I am on my battle pass. Like, if you guys already noticed, I already just purchased like a few level. Like, I already just purchased a few stuff here and there. On my live stream, like I got, or we got, read the manga out of the way. Her, the, her, Linux's Rose's glider. 
And of course the OMG, I love it. But now we got two more. And when I got three more cosmetics out of the way in page seven, I get his Bum Bum Blast. What you say? And of course, Linux Rose. Her secondary style. Then sooner or later, I'll be on page eight. Then I'll be done with page page eight. And then I'll only be all the way down to page ten. And for me to get all of that stuff, 4950 so I can't spend that much B bucks. But if you guys are wondering when's the next stuff might come in towards next cosmetics in the bonus rewards page to page three to page five, that's coming in, in eight days, so that's gonna be like around next week. So yeah. And the hurl she won't be coming into the she won't be coming in until the th until the 36th day in 36 days. So technically, I had a feeling that the hurl might be coming in around. I think. How the, I think somewhere in the, at the end of October, or November. I'm not sure. I have a feeling she might be appearing at the end of of November. I have a theory of that. So yeah. So anyways, I'm gonna end this I'm in this video right here, and this is actually the item short review of today's. And of course the review of the Iron Man Zero bundle. If you guys want to get your hands on the Iron Man Zero bundle, now's the chance to get him. He's only like two thousand V Bucks if you guys don't even come if you guys didn't get his game on the on the Zero War Common Books, even though I got yeah, let me grab it. Like, if you guys never get your hands on these, never get your hands on these Zero War comic books, that's like one, two, and three. I think, yeah, this one is, yeah, the second one is only comes with the gun wrap, so yeah. So if you guys never get your gun wrap, now it's a chance to do it. Or get the rest of the bundle. Now's the chance to do it as well. And of course, there's a. And of course, um, if you guys were wondering, do I have the third? Do I have the fourth or fifth comic books yet? So I did not got it yet. I didn't order. I didn't set the orders of them yet because right now four and five are. Uh, four and five are actually is the spray and the loan screen. So I'm not concerned about that. But but it's up, but even though it's up to me. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and end this video right here. I want to say thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, everybody.